<sighs> I had to ask myself this question so many times. Why does Vector love Vanilla so much? I mean, the guy practically has a crush on her. But, I wonder, will they end up together? Hmm, Vector's a pretty nice guy, even if he's money hungry. But he's just trying to pay rent so he can protect the agency, you know? The Chaotix is, well, doing great. And, uh, Sonic has been giving me these babysitting jobs for Cream. And I like Cream. Cream is awesome. She makes really great food. But, I wonder, does she like me? Because she's very shy. Hmm, I think it might be better if I ask this question. Does Cream like me? No, 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 no. I'm only, like, ten. I don't know how old I am, I forgot. Uh, but that doesn't matter. I shouldn't let my thoughts get too high. What am I saying? I shouldn't let my hopes get too high. Because there's no point in loving a bee. I mean, come on, we fly, we sting. <sighs> I don't even know how Espiel doesn't even have a girlfriend yet. The guy's the nicest dude of all. And he's a ninja. Who wouldn't love a ninja? <sighs> it's a good thing I only babysit Cream. Otherwise, I think my heart would be flying like a bee right now. I wonder, would anyone really like a bee? Hmm. Hmm. I think Cream's still asleep. It's a good thing I decided to take care of her today. Hopefully she didn't hear me. Hmm, I think that's enough looking out the window for one day. What the? Cream? What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be asleep? Well, I was asleep, Mr. Charmy, but I heard you were sad, so I woke up. But you didn't have to wake up for me, though. I, I, I was doing fine. I was just looking out the window, you know? Mr. Charmy, are, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine, Cream. I, I'm still my energetic self. You, you don't have to worry too much. Charmy, you, you really do seem sad. C can, can I please help you out? No, Cream. I swear, I'm fine. It's, I, it's, I, I'm fine, I swear. I'm just looking out the window. Charmy, please calm down. Tell me what's wrong. I don't want to tell you. I feel like it might make you sad, too. I don't care about that, Mr. Charmy. I just want you to feel better. Can I please help you out? Please? <sighs> Alright. I've been asking myself this question for a while now. Why does Vector like vanilla so much? Oh, you, you mean my mama? Yeah, I mean vanilla's great. Who wouldn't like her? And Vector is a pretty nice guy if he's not money hungry. Though... I ask myself, would you like me too? Charmy? Uh, um, uh, uh, sorry, uh, that, that came out wrong. Uh, I, uh, yeah, I was just asking myself this question, you know, I just, you know, I thought it would be nice, I guess, but listen, I, uh, I didn't mean... Charmy, you don't have to ask me that question. Of course I like you. Wait, what? Yeah, um, I do like you. What the? Since when? Uh, let's say Mr. Tails told me a lot about you. And he told me how we were both the same age. And he told me how much stronger you become. <coughs> Mr. Tails? Who's Charmy? Huh? Oh, Charmy. Uh... Charmy is one of my fly buddies. He's a part of a detective agency called the Chaotix. Is it that Mr. Vector's job? Yeah, it, 
Ironically enough, uh, Charmy's a part of it, despite his age. How old is he? Basically the same age as you. Oh. Mm, don't worry, you might like him. He's a bee. A small bee. But he's very strong. Trust me. I think if I'm not there to protect you, he definitely might will. Really? That's what heroes are for, right? When I saw you again, I couldn't bear my excitement. Wait. Are you trying to say... You... Liked me all this time? Uh-huh. I was just really shy. Y you know? Oh. I... Didn't see that coming. <clears throat> well... Yeah. I I'm glad you admit your feelings to me, and... I should... I... I think it's better if I just keep taking care of you from now on. I'm just gonna... Yeah, um... I'm just gonna... Um, uh... Charmy, are you trying to run away? Uh, no! Uh, I was just gonna go, uh, ma probably make myself some fish cakes. Yeah, that's it. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, maybe just, uh, you know, just go ahead. Uh, I'm gonna be right back. I'll be on my... <gasps> Uh, how did you, when did you, why did you? I think you need some rest, Mr. Jeremy. Just lie down for a bit. Maybe take a nap. Would that help? Um, actually, a nap sounds nice. <sighs> oh, this actually feels kind of... Nice. This, this sensation. I haven't felt this sensation in years. <laughs> Maybe it's because of your everlasting energy. Oh yeah, right. That child energy. <laughs> you know, I think this is the start of a beautiful relationship. Relationship? I mean, uh, friendship. Yeah, friendship. Yeah. We never got to talk all that much, so... Yeah, friendship. Nothing else. Nothing more. Nothing less. Yeah. Oh. I look forward to that too, Mr. Charmy. Cream, you don't have to call me Mr. all the time. Just call me Charmy. But... C calling you Mr. Charmy is nicer. Yes, but you can call other people by their names, too, like Mr. Sonic. You know his name is Sonic, right? Yeah. Exactly my point. Just call me Charmy. Charmy B. Okay, Mr. Charmy B. Uh, we're gonna have to work on that. <laughs> At least. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you can call me Mr. Charmy if you want to. Uh-huh, I want to. Hmm, fine. If that's what you want, then I'll accept it. Ah, <sighs> young love. Isn't it beautiful, fellas? Yeah, it really is. It's enough to make a grown man cry. No, seriously, this is amazing. Never thought those two would be together, but here we are. Yeah, young love is indeed rare these days. It's kind of a shame for how love could go so low. <sighs> if only things were easier, like it was back then. Yeah, where love wasn't just an object just for pleasure, it's a shame. We have society to blame for that. But these two might be a good example. I hope they do well together. Come on guys, let's go to Green Hill. Why are we going to Green Hill for? The glory days, Tails. The glory days. Here's my Tails trivia of the day. Well, it's more like a monthly thing now. <laughs> Anyways, if you know how love works, don't treat it as an object, but instead, treat it like it's your priority. If you have a special someone, treat
treat them like... Well, treat them like... Hmm. Oh, right. Treat them the way you want to be treated. Treat them in different ways that will make them feel happy. So that way you'll be happy too. That's all, folks. Thanks for watching. Be sure to hit that like, hit that subscribe, and if you ever want to voice the characters we have, uh, the video for where we're auditioning these voices, well, not really auditioning, but searching for these voices, will be in the description below. Uh, thanks for sticking in for this little story, and we hope to see you next time.